Hello. Hello, Rosita. Hello, Violeta. Hello, Yami. Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you? Fine, thank you. Excellent. I am very happy to see you. Welcome, welcome. Good evening. Hello, good evening. Welcome to your class. How was your day? How was your weekend? ¿Qué tal su día, su semana? Su fin de semana. Very good. Very good. What did you do? What did you do on your weekend? Uh -huh. Oh, really? Oh, my God. Ay, that's so sad. What happened? Pues, se, se complicó con el COVID ya una señora, pero no estaba tan mayor, pero ahora la enterramos. I know, I am very sad. I am very sorry for that. Oh, sí. yeah. It's, 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 those are like the difficult parts of, of everything, right? Yeah. yeah. What can we do? Oh, well, I'm very sorry for that news. So, eh, what about the rest? Okay, Rosita estaba con malas noticias. I see. I know it's very sad, right? Then, then you really appreciate and you say like, mm, pude haber compartido más con ella. You say. It, it just happened. Hello, good evening. Hello, Wendita. Hello, Cynthia. Hello, Hello Violeta. Hello, Roberto. Mireya, how are you? Yeah, me. Voy por mis ojos, permitan. <laughs> Go for your eyes. Go and get your eyes. Okay, yeah. I'm ready. ready. I'm ready. You say, welcome. My God, you see, time does fly. Wow. El tiempo sí que vuela. Estamos en la última semana de trabajo. Wow. Yeah. The time is just like this, right? It flies very fast. And... On the last class, we were talking about food, right? We were talking a lot about food. I love la exactly like that. We were saying <laughs> the things that we love, the things that we hate, the things that we eat, and the things that we don't like to eat, right? That's what we were talking, and we were discussing a lot about the different vocabulary. I don't know. Exactly, like. right? You say, I love, I like, and I don't like. And we were also talking a little bit about the countables and uncountable nouns, the ones that you can count and make plural and the ones that you cannot count and make plural, right? We are going to start the class with a short conversation, right? And in this one, we are going to see the difference between some in any, okay? Uy, tengo un pito por ahí. And in this one, here we have some and any. And here we go. Some, right? And any. Any is for the negative forms, right? Some, it's for uh, affirmative sentences and plurals. And any is for the negatives and the questions, right? For negatives and questions. It is any. And we're going to see how we use it. What do you want for the picnic? It says, what do you want for the picnic? Hmm, how about some sandwiches? Mm -hmm. Okay, we have some chicken in the refrigerator, but we don't have any bread and we don't have any cheese. Do we have any drinks? No, we need some. All right, let's get some lemonade and let's buy some potato salad. Sure, everyone likes potato salad, okay? So here we have, practice with me. What do you want for the picnic? What do you want for the picnic? What do you want for the picnic? For the picnic, and it says, mm, how about some sandwiches? Mm -hmm. How about some sandwiches? 
Okay, we have some chicken in the refrigerator, but we don't okay. have any bread. Okay, oh, we have some chicken, chicken in the refrigerator, but we don't have any bread. any bread. And we don't have any cheese. And we don't have any cheese. Do we have any drinks? Do we have any drinks? drinks? No, we need some. No, no we, need we need some. some. All right, let's get some lemonade. All right, let's, let's get some lemon. And let's buy some potato salad. And let's buy some potato salad. Sure. 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 Everyone likes potato salad. Everyone, everyone likes potato salad. Everyone likes potato salad. Everyone likes potato salad. Everyone. Everyone likes potato salad. Do you like potato salad, people? Le gusta? Le gusta la ensalada de papa? Yep. Yes. Yes. Son y any. ¿Qué quiere decir son? Okay. Uno, algunos. Right? Say some. How about some sandwiches? Some sandwiches. ¿Qué te parecen algunos sandwiches? In this case, when you have, we have some chicken. Tenemos un poco de pollo. Tenemos un poco de pollo. Some es para afirmativos. Okay? We have some chicken. We have some water. We have some coffee, you can say. That's some. And any, it's like we don't have any cheese. No hay nada de queso. We don't have any cheese. Y any, any lo ocupamos para las preguntas. Para decir, tenemos, no, lo ocupamos para negativo y preguntas. We don't have any cheese. And we say, like, do we have any drinks? ¿Tendremos algunas bebidas? Because you, we don't know, right? No, we need some, right? If you think about your refrigerator, si piensan acerca de su refri ahorita, díganme algunas cosas que tienen, afirmativas. And it says, I have some tomatoes, some tortillas, I have some onions. Sodas. I have some sodas, okay? I have some cake. Wait, wait, wait. What do you have in your refrigerator? I have some beans. <laughs> I have some beans. Good. ¿Qué más uh, tiene en el refri? Some milk. I have some milk. Very good. Potato. Potatoes. I have some potatoes. I have a cheese. I have some onion. I have some cheese. I have some cheese. I have some cheese. I have some onions, good. What else? Do you have lemons in your refrigerator? Yes. Okay, so you say, I have, I have some? Lemon. I have some lemons. Tell me something that you don't have. I can say, I don't have any chocolates. I have este, the zanahoria. El, el, Carrot. I have some carrots. You say, I have some carrots. I have some carrots. Díganme algo que no tienen. I don't have any chocolate. I don't have, I don't have any what? ¿Qué no I tienen en su milk. milk. I don't have I don't any have milk. milk. So you say, I don't have any milk. Any. Ajá. Uh -huh. ¿Qué más no tienen en la refri? I don't have any cheese. Any soda. Any cheese, any soda. Hmm. Cream. I don't have any cream. I don't have any ice cream. Ice cream. <laughs> yeah, I don't have any ice cream. Ya, yeah, como quisiera terminar la clase y tener un poquito de ice cream ahí. <laughs> I don't have any ice cream in the refrigerator. Ash. I don't have any, any cake. Ya no hay pastel, ya se lo acaban. I don't have any cake. What else? I don't have any, any pollo campero in my refrigerator. <laughs> I don't have any pizza, any pupusas, right? I don't have any pupusas in the refrigerator. Do you have, do you have all tortillas in your refrigerator? ¿Hay alguna tortilla vieja ahí? <laughs> Aha, uh -huh. there are some, right? <laughs> there are some things. 
What is the most common thing that you always have? Algo que siempre va a encontrar en un refrigerador salvadoreño. Tomatoes. Tomatoes. There are some tomatoes. Water, water mm. right? Water oh, or the water. pitcher of water, mm. right? O si no, solo el puro pichel. Sin agua. Botella vacía. Exactly. Empty bottles, right? Some empty bottles. That it's very common that we find empty bottles, right? So here I have the little explanation for the topic. And it says any and some. We have countables and uncountables. And here we have, do we need some any eggs? eggs? Do we need any yes. eggs? Let's yes. get some. No, we don't mm -hmm. need any, right? Do we need any bread? Yes, let's get some. No, we don't need any. In this case, when you say we don't need any, significa ningún pan, pues. I don't need any bread, and you can say. With the countable nouns, we have to be very careful because with the countable nouns, we have, for example, here, an egg, right? An egg is solo uno. Y le ponemos un, una, ¿verdad? un huevo, un sandwich. Porque no podemos decir a sandwiches, porque sería un sandwiches, un huevos. And that's not correct, right? So you say an egg, porque estamos hablando de singular, en plural, eggs. Okay, I need eggs. For example, if you want to make pupusas, what materials do you need? ¿Qué materiales necesitan? To make pupusas. Beans. Beans. Cheese. 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 Uh -huh. Oil. Um, Oil. Corn. Corn. Corn flour. Uh -huh. Tomatoes. Tomatoes. Vinagre. Vinegar, good vinegar. Sal. Salt. What else? Salt. Y la, 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 la masa Abbas. de harina. Ah, that's corn flour. Corn flour. Corn flour. Flour. Corn flour. Flour is la, la masa. Corn flour. La masa. The next oh, one. Flour. For the noun count. You don't say a or an, okay? Los incontables no llevan ni a ni an, okay? Bread, lemonade, milk. No decimos a milk. No decimos a cereal, okay? Como les explicaba el, el, el jueves. And for a specific things, I am eating an egg. Let's get some bread, right? Eggs are good for you. Bread is good for you. So in this one, remember that we have some and any. Some is for affirmatives and any is for negatives and questions, okay? So let's practice. Veamos aquí. It says, the store doesn't have any potato salad. ¿Por qué pusimos any aquí? Porque es una negativa, right? We have, the store doesn't have any potato salad because we have a negative sentence. Well, we have lots of potatoes. Let's make, esta es una afirmativa, que vamos a ocupar aquí, some or any. Some. Some, some right? Let's get some. Um, Do we need? Esa es una regla. Sí. Para las afirmativas, some. Para las negativas y las preguntas, any. Si esta es pregunta, do we mayonnaise, que vamos a poner aquí? Um. ¿Cuál ocupamos para las preguntas? Any. Any. Do we have any mayonnaise? No, we need to buy. Necesitamos comprar. Ah, este. Some. Some. Ok. Porque este no, no es la negativa de la pregunta. Este no es la respuesta de la pregunta anterior. Do we have any mayonnaise? No. Y de ahí decimos, we need to buy some. Tenemos que comprar un poco. We need onions too. Some. Some. We some. need some onions too, right? I don't want any. Any. Some. No, any. I don't some. want. Yo no quiero. I don't want any onions. I hate onions, right? Odio las yes. cebollas. Then let's get some. Some celery. 
No, I don't want any. Any. Oh, any. I don't want any celery in my potato salad. Okay, but let's put some apples some. in it. Some apples in it. Apples in potato salad. That sounds awful. And it's very delicious. A mí me encantan las manzanas y la, en la ensalada de papa. Apple. Oh, that's delicious. Apples in potato salad. That sounds awful. So, some is for affirmatives. Any is for negatives and questions. Okay? Let's do other examples. Okay, leamos esta conversación. I am going to be Amanda and you are Adam. Okay? The store doesn't have any potato salad. Well... well we have of lots potato. of potatoes. We have lots of potatoes. Let's make some. Okay, do we have any mayonnaise? Okay, no. do you have any we need, mayonnaise? To buy some. we need to buy some. We need some onions too. Oh, I don't want... I don't want any onions. Any onions. I, I hate onions. onions. Then let's get some celery. No, no I don't, no, I don't, I don't want, want any, any celery, celery in my potato, potato salad. Potato salad. But, but let's put let's some put apples in it. it. Apples in potato apples salad. In potato salad. That, that sounds awful. That sounds awful. awful. So, Questions about vocabulary? Preguntas de vocabulario apple. del párrafo? Awful. Awful is horrible. Awful. Más allá de lo horrible. Awful. <laughs> celery. Celery is apio. I love you. Any other question? So. So. Huh? So. Celery is Which one? Which one? Ah, that apple. sounds awful. Awful? Apple. Okay, apple. el significado de awful es más que horrible, fatal. That sounds awful, you say. Right? <laughs> es como quesadilla con frijoles. It's like, what? That sounds awful. What? <laughs> when, when you eat, for example, quesadilla, the bread, el, el pan, la quesadilla. Uh -huh. With beans. Uh, no. That sounds awful. It's like, wakala, que feo eso, right? <laughs> it I is like that. Pero hay una que le gusta, <laughs> uh -huh. le gusta el frijol entero con, con quesadilla. He conocido personas comiendo eso. <laughs> Pero I like que it. Como tamales con crema. Ajá, well, yo lo pongo con limón. Con limón. Los de lote. De lemon. Ajá, pero los de, lim <risa> los de lote con limón. Con Le crema. No, al, al de gallina he oído que le ponen Ajá. limón. Ok, oh. so you see. What is something strange that you love to eat? ¿Qué es lo más extraño que a ustedes les gusta? Y que alguien diría, that sounds awful. Al menos ya conocieron el mío, ¿eh? la que sabía con frijoles licuados. Pero rica la que sabía. De apple green. Jamón y queso. Green apple. Ah. Green apple with what? Uh, con sal. Ah, oh, green apple and salt. Yeah, that, that's delicious, right? It's like green mango with salt. It's very delicious. Sí. But, but a strange combination that you say, ah, really? Y eso te lo comes, segura? Yeah, I like it. Lo salado con lo dulce. Ok, salty, salty and sweet. Uh -huh. ah, hay unas boquitas que se hacen de plátano maduro, pero con... Con, con tocino. Bacon, con tocino, así enrolladito. I love Esas that. I love it, yeah. I, I prepare those sí, plátano for... Plátano con tocino. Plátano with bacon. Bananas with bacon. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Roberto, any strange combination that you like? ¿Alguna combinación rara que le guste? 
No rara, pero quizás es común, pero me gusta, es la de tamal de lote con frijoles. Es rico. Tamal de lote con you see, wow. Tamal de lote con frijoles. Mire ella. Ah, in the middle of the coffee, sorry. Tamales pisques. Tamales pisques, yeah, the ones who have beans inside, los que tienen frijolitos adentro. Uh, let's see, Vilma Concepción. Um, sí. rara. Ajá, una cosa rara que le guste comer que todos dijeran ah what's that A strange combinations piénsenlo <laughs> Cynthia A strange combinations piensen ahí sus combinaciones que no les dé pena o sea, todos tenemos un pasado oscuro <laughs> <laughs> a strange combination. Uso, uso raro. Yeah, that you say like, uh -huh. really? Well, the pizza and the pineapple, that's that's one that it's common, but many people don't like it, right? Hay mucha gente que no le gusta. And it says like, what? Pizza with pineapple? Ilk. And they don't like it, right? What is another one that you say, yeah, that's strange, but I love it. Otra combinación rara. Uh -huh. Son los rellenos de flor y sote, teacher. Oh my God. I like it. De flor de sote, camán. <risa> ya, hablamos, oh. ya hablamos de los símbolos patrios. Don't eat, don't eat the national symbols, people. Don't eat the national symbols. A mí me gusta, teacher. Ok, let's see. Give me a, a mí second. también son ricos. <laughs> They are very delicious, you say. They are very delicious combinations. Ok, give me a second. Le voy a pasar lista antes que la lluvia nos saque otra vez a todos. Ya va a llover, teacher. No, hay, hay, hay lugares donde está lloviendo muy recio, pero antes de que nos saque a los chicos de nuevo la lluvia, le puede pasar lista. Veamos. Ok, es que bien unos que pusieron en el chat que no se pueden conectar y de repente veo que se conectan y se desconectan, así que le voy a pasar lista mejor ahorita. Ok, so you see, crazy combinations, right? I, I know people who eat tamales with sauce, with pupusa sauce con esa salsa de pupusa. And they, they, they eat the tamales with that and they say that it's delicious. Pupusas con crema, he visto que comen a Yeah, persona. I have seen that too. I have seen the pupusas con crema, uh, pupusas with mayonnaise in, in San Miguel. In San Miguel. Pupusas with mayonnaise, yes. Ay, le gusta. Yeah, I have seen the pupusas with mayonnaise and with black sauce. Con salsa negra también. Huevo picado con ketchup. Oh, that's delicious, Verónica. Esos and son I, ricos. And also with tortilla. Huevo con tortilla frita. That's very delicious. Ok. Sí, uh -huh. Totopostes. Totopostes. Mm. Ah, yeah, they are very good. I love the totopostes. They are very no. delicious. Las tostacas. Son Las ricas. tostacas as well. Los frijoles con cebolla entera. La uh, que? I, <laughs> beans with onion, okay. Yeah, I like the, the, the flavor, pero no me como la cebolla. Me gusta el sabor que le das, más no la cebolla. Completa. Rica la cebolla. Yeah, I, 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 I take it out. <laughs> Yo se la, se la quito, pero me gusta. Okay, Ana Leticia. Oh. Ana Leticia. She's not here. Okay, Ana Yamilet. Ana Yamilet. Uy, oh my God. Eh, Cintia Marisol. Yes, Thank you. Eh, Daniel Edgardo. Danielita. No vino ahora. Es mimido. Ok, he estado mimido. Eh, Fátima Ivín. Fátima. Bienvenido, Tich. Sí, la vi por un momento. 
Mayerly Alejandra. I think Mayerly, yes. Dice que hay una gran tormenta en su casa, dice. Okay, Estoy deseando que llueva, de hecho. Hay todos. <laughs> ok. And let's see, uh, Mayerly Yamilet. Yamilet, yeah. thank you. Arroz. Mire, uh, ajá, arroz con qué? Con arroz frijoles con... y jalapeño y chile. No, but that's good. It's a very delicious thing. It's a very delicious thing. And avocado. Mire, ya Beatriz. Present. Thank you. Eh, Mirna Yasmin. Present. Nelson Efraín. Hey, mi Nelson, ya, no, ya nos, nos han dado updates de cómo siguió. Nubia Daisy. Present, teacher. Reina Yael. Present. Roberto Carlos. Present. Rosa María. Present, teacher. Roxana Yasmín. Present. Roxana Yamilet. Sandra Beatriz. Present. Ubaldo. That never connected. Verónica Elizabeth. Verónica. Thank you. Present teacher. She said on the chat. Vilma Concepción. Present teacher. Vilma Isabel. Present teacher. Violeta Elizabeth. Present teacher. Wendy Lisette. Jennifer Damisela. Jennifer, she didn't connect. Okay, so uh, people, it is important if you want to resign for the next module. Si se quieren inscribir y si se si se van a inscribir al siguiente módulo, yo sé que se van a inscribir porque el que empieza a estudiar no tiene que dejar de estudiar. Se tienen que seguir trabajando. Uh, send the information, okay? Send the information. Envíen su documentación. Es bien importante para que no se queden sin cupo. Okay, that was the announcement of the day. Let's continue working here. Let me see. So we have these strange combinations, right? State strange combinations of food that you say, oh, that sounds awful, right? That sounds awful. So here we have a short example. What do you need to make these things? What do you need to make these preparations? To make a chicken sandwich, you need some bread, chicken, lettuce, and mayonnaise. You don't need any cheese. What do you need to prepare a cheeseburger? What do you need to prepare a cheeseburger? You need, you need some bread, what else? Lettuce. 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 Tomato. 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 Onion. Onion. Cheese. Cheese. What else? Mostaza. Mustard. Uh -huh. What else do you need? ¿Qué más necesitan para una hamburguesa? Meat. Meat, ketchup. right? You need meat. You need ketchup. And I think just that, right? You need uh, jalapenos. Yeah. Beef, right? Pepinillos. <laughs> pickles. You need pickles. Pickles. What is something that you don't need? You don't need any. What is something that you don't need? You don't need any. ¿Qué es algo que no necesitan para una hamburguesa? You don't need any lemon. Good. You don't need any lemon. What else? Egg. Egg. Uh, Sugar, bananas, fish, or fish. <laughs> okay, fish. fish. Okay, milk. we have or milk. <laughs> you don't need any milk. 
for a cheeseburger, you need some bread, lettuce, tomato, onion, cheese, mustard, meat, ketchup, and pickles, right? And pickles. And pickles. Lettuce. Lettuce, yes. You lettuce. don't need any lemon, egg, sugar, or fish, right? That is something that you don't need, okay? You need and what you don't need. I have some other examples, right? Ya tienen dos ejemplos aquí. Les voy a dar otras dos cosas. What do you need to prepare a vegetable salad and a fruit salad? Necesito que lo escriban en su cuaderno. I need you to write it on your notebook. What you need for a fruit what? salad, write it on your notebook. Eso lo van a escribir primero en su cuaderno y después me lo what van a leer. What you need, ¿verdad? Okay, in this case, you say, you need, ta, 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 you need some, you need some, and after all the ingredients, después de que escriban todo lo que sí necesitan, me van a decir, you don't need any, ta, 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 ta. it's the same here, okay? You have the same here and the same here in the fruit salad, but write it on your notebook. Escríbanlo porque de ahí me lo van a leer. You can add all the ingredients that you want. Póngale todos los que quieran. You need and you don't need. Tiene, me avisa. You can just raise your hand in camera. A vegetable salad and a fruit salad.
vegetable salad. Okay. Okay, uh, Roxana and then Vilma. Um, you um, need some onion, tomato. Eh, se escribe carrot, pero no sé cómo pronunciarlo. Carrot. 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 Uh, lettuce, ¿qué es lechuga? Lettuce. Lettuce. Uh, lettuce. Eh, repollo, que es cumber, ¿se pronuncia? Cabbage. Uh, cabbage. Uh, you don't need any fish, egg, uh, cheese. Okay, very good. For the vegetable salad, you don't need any of that. Thank you very much, Roxana. Good job. Vilma Concepcion. Okay. Uh, you need uh, some lettuce, tomato, broccoli. A lemon, carrots, onion. You don't need any rice, sugar, bread, and banana. Okay, maybe bread in the croutons, right? Los croutones son los clotes de pan que le ponen a la ensalada, the croutons. But Croton. maybe you need it, right? But but you don't yes, need it on this one. And me, you need, okay. you need a cucumber, cucumber, no? Yeah, cucumber. Uh, tomato, bean, egg, lettuce, or, 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 aceite. Oil. Um, oil. Oil. Oil, yes, oil. Oil, oil. 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 Uh -huh. What is something that you don't need? Rosita, ¿qué era lo que no necesitaba? Ah, este, ahí no, como para no decir, no necesito, como dice. I don't I, need. ¿Cómo? I don't need. I don't need a uh, um, uh, yogurt. Uh -huh. uh, milk. Milk. Cheese. Cheese. Okay, you don't need any cheese. That's good. Very good, Wendy. Okay. Thank. Thank you, Rosita. I need uh... I need, uh, I need some tomato, lettuce, spinach, spinach. green paper, spinach, green, green pepper. Paper, pepper, pepper, red paper, onion, chili, cucumber, crotons, dijo, ¿verdad? Cro crotons, Cro yeah, Cro crotons. And celery. And celery, I good. Uh -huh. I don't need any milk. Beans and meat. You don't need any meat, right? Very good job. And let's see, Sandra, can you help me with the fruit salad? I need some bananas, apple, grapes. <laughs> Um, eh, quiero ver. I don't, I don't need any eh, lech, lettuce, lettuce, uh -huh. lettuce, ham, ham, uh -huh. eh, eh, quiero ver. onion. Onions, right? You don't need any onions for the fruit salad. Very good job, Sandra. Excellent. And I am going to ask Roberto for the fruit salad. What do you need? I need some uh, grapes. 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 Apple. Apples. Apple. Pepini apple. 
Pineapples. Pineapples. Pineapple. Melon. Melon, uh huh. Watermelon. Watermelon. Etc. 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 And all the that's a very simple <laughs> answer, right? Es una solución bien sencilla para la pregunta. Etc. 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 Good. Very good job. Well, so based on this, I have here some other ingredients, right? Por aquí les tengo otros ingredientes. But in these ones, what, what's something that you can see on the picture? ¿De qué tipo de ingredientes estamos hablando? Ingredients for? Para desayuno. How do you say desayuno in English? Breakfast. Breakfast. Breakfast, breakfast right? You breakfast. have breakfast. What, what are the different the different uh, food that you can eat in the day? So you eat breakfast, right? You eat lunch, lunch, lunch. You eat dinner, right? You eat dinner, or you can eat the supper, right? The supper it's the same as dinner. Es como la comida de la noche, la cena. Eso sería como la cena. Supper. Dinner or supper. And you also eat the snacks. Okay. The snacks are the ones that you eat between the meals. Okay. Meals in general significan comidas. Todas las comidas en general se llaman meals. Okay. Meals. Meals son las comidas en general. What is the most important meal of the day? ¿Cuál es la comida más importante del día? Breakfast. The breakfast, right? Breakfast. The breakfast. Breakfast and lunch and dinner and snack. <laughs> all, of the, all of them are in Every. Every. So, the breakfast is in the morning, right? The lunch is in the middle of the morning. But there is something that people do, for example, on Sunday that it's called Brunch. brunch. ¿Qué es el brunch? El brunch es ese desayuno que ya se come como a las diez y media. Mm, brunch. ¿Qué se dice? Ajá, vamos a hacer un brunch, decimos. ¿Qué pasa? Eso lo hacemos el domingo, por ejemplo. Que dicen, ay, vamos a ir a misa y después de misa comemos, ¿verdad? Hay, hay gente que sí lo hace y ya comen como a las diez y media. Entonces vienen almorzando como a las tres de la tarde. Right? <risa> That is a brunch. A brunch is como un breakfast y lunch al mismo tiempo. Ahí se ahorra una comida. Madre del futuro. Solo hagan brunch. El niño se levantó a las 11. Ya, desayuno, almuerzo, hijo de una vez. <laughs> There is no option, right? That's a brunch. And the dinner. Dinner is the one that you eat at night, right? Esa es la que se come en la noche. Dinner. Puede también llamarse supper. Pero eso es como más británico. El supper. El más común American English, it's dinner. And the snacks are the ones that you eat between the meals. Okay, como a las 10 de la mañana que usted dice, ah, me voy a comer esta frutita, me voy a comer este mango, me voy a comer esto. So that's a, that's a snack. Okay, hay gente que hace unas snacks un poco grandes, ¿verdad? Tres cucuzos. <laughs> Un juguito, dos cafés, tres panes con el café. So that's a big snack, right? Y después, no sé por qué no tengo hambre en el almuerzo. <laughs> Because you ate a lot of food for the yes. snack. So these are yes. examples of things of uh, for breakfast. What are the things that you recognize here? That you recognize in a breakfast for you? We have... And let, let me explain. We have eggs, eggs bacon, 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 toast with butter, toast with butter, tostada orange, con mantequilla, orange, orange juice, coffee, coffee jam ye, or jelly, jam, right? Jelly. Jelly, jelly es la gelatina. Falta la acepto. <laughs> me ofende, pero me lo pongo. <laughs> Jam or jelly is la jalea, ¿verdad? Con jalea, ¿para qué? Para las tostadas. Ham and jelly, right? The bacon. I am missing the beans aquí. Aquí les pondría yo los frijoles. Adoptaría los frijoles para aquí. No, estamos bien. No. Here you have fish, rice, fish. 
I so saw pickles, green tea, because this one is in Japan. They eat fish for breakfast, right? So pickles, pickles, pepinillos, right? Yes. Green tea. They drink green but tea. Lunch. No, yeah, but this is breakfast in Japan. And in this one, we have eggs, beans, tortillas, fresh fruit, sweet bread, and coffee, coffee. with milk. This is in Mexico. This is the most common one to El Salvador. What is the only thing that we are missing here? ¿Qué lo haría salvadoreño? <laughs> the pupusa. No, the fried bananas, people. The fried bananas, el plátano frito. In a piece of avocado. Uh, That's the only thing that it's missing. The right? crema y el queso. The cream and the cheese, right? The cream and the cheese. That sí. will make it. La, ¿Cómo se dice crema, teacher? Cream. 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 El casamiento. El casamiento, right? The beans and rice. The beans and rice mix. The bread, right? The bread. The French bread. The bread. And for sure, well, the tortillas are good for breakfast. I like them, right? I like tortillas for breakfast. But there you have fruit, sweet bread, right? Tienen un pequeño panecillo por aquí. Una pequeña conchita. <laughs> and here you have eggs, beans, tortillas, French fruit, sweet bread, and coffee with milk. So, which one would you prefer? Preferirían desayunar in the US, in Japan, or in Mexico? Mexico. I like Mexico. Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for the beans, right? Yeah, the beans, they are so delicious. But the beans, I, I mean, you can have everything. Puede haber de todo en la casa, pero si no hay frijoles, usted así como. A mí me pasa. Ay, no. Right, we need we need the beans in our lives, right? Para mí está perfecto el US. Yeah, definitely. A mí me pasó en un viaje en cuando estaba en en la beca en Arkansas, allá no habían frijoles normales, vean, son los frijoles como dulces. Y un día me dicen, mira, hay frijoles en el buffet y yo, eran dulces. Los hacen con ketchup y con carne de cerdo. They were so terrible. No, but they were sweet. Then I come over you. Agredulce. Then I'm like, what? Then I'm horrible. And I was like, me offenden, pero me los como. Because they are beings, right? So, beings, Mexico, it's, it's the most common one similar to El Salvador, right? It's the most similar one to El Salvador. Let's read this conversation. It's one of them. It's one of my favorite conversations of this book. And it says, let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Okay, come to my house. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sundays. Really? What do you have? We usually have fish, rice, and soup. Fish for breakfast. Hmm, that's interesting. Sometimes we have a salad too. And we always have a green tea. Well, I never eat fish for breakfast, but I like to try new things. It's like, mm, fish for breakfast? That's interesting, right? Pecado para el desayuno. Interesante, you say. Well, if you wake up in El Mahawal, they offer you fish for breakfast. Allá le ofrecen pescado para el desayuno. Si está en El Mahawal en la mañana. Si va al puerto en la mañana, fish for breakfast. And it, it's good, right? Pescado frito con frijoles. It's very good. <laughs> In the morning, it's very delicious. Practice with me. Let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Let's have, Let's breakfast. have breakfast together on Sunday. Let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Let's have breakfast on Sunday. Okay, come to my house. Okay, come to my house. 
My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sundays. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sundays. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sundays. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sundays. Japanese style. Japanese style. Japanese. Japanese. Japanese style. Japanese. Japanese style. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sundays. My family always has a Japanese style breakfast on Sundays. Really? 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 What do you have? What what do you have? We usually have fish. We usually have fish. fish. We usually. We usually. Usually, usually. Usually. We usually have fish, rice, and soup. We usually have fish, rice, and soup. And soup. Okay, tenemos que tener cuidado porque soup y soup son dos cosas distintas. En el caso de soup, aquí se lo voy a poner. Soup es sopa. Soup. Y soap es jabón. Okay, no me va a decir. We usually have fish, rice, and soap. Mm, puro palmonide. And <laughs> soup. You say and soup. Fish for breakfast. That's interesting. Fish for breakfast. Fish for breakfast. Así como, ¿qué? Pescado para el desayuno. Fish for breakfast. Fish for breakfast. That's interesting. That's, That's interesting. interesting. Sometimes we have a salad too. Sometimes we have a salad too. And we always have green tea. And we always have green tea. Well, I never eat fish for breakfast. Well, well, I, I never eat fish for breakfast. But I like to try new things. But, but I like to try new things. 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 I like I like to try to try to try okay to try no porque me hace to try no I like to try new things new things Okay. Teacher en español sería, pero podemos probar algo nuevo. Pero me gusta probar cosas nuevas. Ok, así como, mm, bueno, yo okay. nunca como pescado para el desayuno, pero me gusta probar cosas nuevas. Right, but I like to try new things. Ah, okay. It's like, ah, te molesta. I like to try yes. new things, right. I like to try new things. So, in this case, things, you say things, things. In, important things, important things to remember on the things, the things. Say breakfast. 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 A Japanese style breakfast. A Japanese, A Japanese style breakfast. breakfast. We, usually we usually have fish. We usually have fish. Have fish. That's interesting. That's interesting. 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 We have a salad too. We, we have, have a salad too. too. I never eat fish for breakfast. I never eat fish for fish for breakfast. I like to try new things. I like to try new 
new things. Okay, I like to try new things. In this one, we say, I like to try new things. I like to try new things. New I like to try new things. In these phrases, in this conversation, we have sentences like this. And it says like, my family always has a Japanese style breakfast. We usually have fish, right? We usually have fish. And we have, sometimes we have a salad too. Here we have another one. Sometimes we have a salad too. And we always have green tea, right? Always is another one. I never eat fish for breakfast. Okay, estas palabras que les marco aquí, let me just clarify a little bit. I'm going to do it with pink. These ones, always, usually, sometimes, always, never, they are, adverbs of frequency adverbs of frequency because they say the frequency of an activity ellos nos dan la frecuencia de una actividad que tan frecuente es algo que hacemos right you say like my family always has a japanese style breakfast on sundays que significa siempre. always siempre, siempre. siempre. Right? cada domingo que es lo que van a hallar en la casa de kumiko cada domingo Ish. A Japanese <laughs> style Japanese breakfast. breakfast. Always, right? Always. Por ejemplo, si su mamá cada vez que visita en la casa se pollo guisado, dice, my mother always has pollo guisado for the visitors. They say like, hey, va a venir no sé quién, hagamos un pollo. Guisado. Un pollo guisado para que abunde, they say. And they always do the same for Christmas. You have the Christmas chicken all the time, right? No hay otra cosa en el mundo más que pollo, gallina, no sé qué, con rey. No hay pollo, teacher. All the things, right? Or turkey. Si es pavo, lo que sea, con el mismo recaudo. Toda la <laughs> There is no other thing. We always eat the same, right? Ese, ese se le llama tradición. Yes, it's the traditional chicken for Christmas, right? <laughs> Always. <laughs> and it's not for Christmas, right? It's 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. You eat like seven days. <laughs> you always eat the same. Right? Yeah. Definitely. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, ya el pobre Kaiser ya ni se lo quiere comer. Ya como el noveno día. <laughs> nah. Noveno. No, ya ni llega el segundo día entre todo el recalentado que se hace. Always is 100% of the time. Always es el 100% del tiempo. Usually, sería como la mayoría de las veces. We usually have fish, rice, and soup, right? Es lo usual. Usualmente, sería como un 80% del tiempo. Sometimes, veces. Sometimes we have a salad too. Eso quiere decir que la ensalada es opcional porque no todas las veces la tienen, un 50% de las veces. But if I say, I never eat fish for breakfast, never, zero, nunca, right? I never eat fish for breakfast. And these are called adverbs of frequency, okay? This is the name and I am going to write it here. These are called adverbs of frequency adverbs of frequency and there are many more we have for definite frequency and indefinite frequency indefinite frequency and what is the difference we are going to study in the class tomorrow. Eso es lo que vamos a estudiar en la clase del día de mañana. Pero ¿por qué se los doy ya? Para que ustedes los empiecen a investigar ahora. Bueno, hoy no. Mañana. Ya les voy a enviar en el chat. Adverse of frequency. Definite frequency and indefinite frequency. ¿Cuáles son los de frecuencia indefinida? Estos que les estoy mostrando ahorita. Always, usually, sometimes, never, almost always. Porque no es un día específico. Pero si yo les digo, every morning, oh, cada yeah. mañana, every Sunday, 
cada domingo. Those are definite frequency. Ahí sí es frecuencia definitiva porque sabemos que es cada domingo, cada mañana. Every day at seven in the morning. It's todos los días a las siete en punto. Definite frequency. So that is what we are going to study in the class tomorrow. And please take notes, okay? Tomen nota, mis queridos chicos, de lo que vamos a estudiar. Se lo voy a enviar ahorita al chat para que lo podamos investigar. So you are ready for the class tomorrow. Have a beautiful night, my dear students. Rest a lot and please investigate a little bit about the topics, okay? If you haven't sent the documents, send it so you can keep a space for the next module. Así que me aseguro que ustedes tengan su espacio en el siguiente módulo para que podamos trabajar este módulo, los que vienen y todos los que siguen, okay? Envíen su documentación. Dice, teacher? <laughs> Definitely. Ahí van, pero para que estemos para que todos tengan su espacio en el siguiente módulo. Please, please, please. I hope, I hope. Yo así estoy haciendo changuitos con los dedos. Para que me pongan ustedes de nuevo. Sí, teacher. Yeah, for us to continue learning. Y así seguimos aprendiendo juntos. And please, send the documents. Save your space. Have a beautiful night. Investigate about the topics. And I will see you tomorrow for another class. Hey, teacher. Bye, 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 my dear. Thank you. Bye, 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 bye. Have a beautiful bye, night. Bye. Vamos a Bye. Bye. Take care. Bye, bye.